Hello, it's Lex MPI, back with another video, and today we're talking Goose Finance. Before I get started, please like and subscribe, it'll be much appreciated. So Goose Finance, it's another Binance Smart Chain decentralized exchange where you can make use of yield farming to increase um, your returns. The Binance Smart Chain, if you've already been watching the channel, you know that I'm a big bull on the Binance Smart Chain. Uh, very cheap fees when compared to Ethereum, blah de blah. You've heard it all before, um, so I won't bore you with the details. Uh, this video, I'm not going to go through how uh, yield farming works and how um, decentralized exchanges work. I'm going to assume you know that. Um, I'll put links in the cards above for videos where I go into more detail in regards to um, yield farming and DEXs. Um, but let me just show you through Goose Finance and show you how you can make some pretty decent uh, yields and returns on your investments here on Goose Finance. So Goose Finance is a relatively new cryptocurrency. Let me show you it on CoinMarketCap. So here we are, CoinMarketCap. So here we are, Goose Finance. It's actually done pretty well. It's up 21% today, uh, which is pretty good. So I'll show you the chart. Um, so it's been around since mid-Feb. Um, went, went to a crazy peak of 150. So let's turn quickly, egg is the ticker symbol for Goose Finance. When I refer to EGG, that is the native token for Goose Finance. Um, so went to 160, so that's, that's the all time high. And we're down here at um, at 16. So interesting to see that what, what the potential may be, I'm not saying it's gonna go up there, but as you can see, it's near a bottom here. It's been at the price has been languishing for a while, which is a good thing, guys. You wanna buy low, sell high. You wanna buy it when no one's looking. You don't want to be chasing pumps. You don't want to be buying it up here when you know everyone's already made the money. You want to be buying it low. So um, I'm in. Obviously, this is not financial advice. Of course, I'm telling you what I'm doing. Um, but my strategy is to buy low, sell high. So you're going to catch me while I was buying around here, guys. So uh, that's that's the, that's the cryptocurrency. So um, as always, Coin Market Cap has all the links to their uh, website, etc. Check it out. So back to Goose Finance. I'll just talk you through exactly how the, the website works and you know, hopefully how you can make some gains. Down here is the price you pay. So that is uh, the egg price. So egg is $20 uh, per coin. Um, the trade bit is very similar to most exchanges here where essentially it shows you where you, you know, where you can exchange cryptocurrency. So very simple, if I have some, why is that loading up? Taking so long, but if I had some ADA and I wanted to swap it for uh, BNB, I could do that, actually, I'll do it vice versa. I have some BNB, so I could convert my BNB into ADA, and I'd get 30 ADA for my 0 0.61 BNB. Pretty simple. You can also add liquidity. So this is adding liquidity to a decentralized exchange. Adding liquidity to a decentralized exchange means you're supplying liquidity, which allows those exchanges to take place. So that conversion you saw, ADA uh, and, and uh, BNB, Adding liquidity as a liquidity provider would mean that it's actually your cryptocurrency that's allowing that exchange to take place. And for that, you receive a fee. Um, if I go quickly back to the exchange, when I click that and I did that to lit I'll do link this time. Um, if I try to swap that, what you'll see is that there is a liquidity provider fee. And that fee is 0.2% of the amount being exchanged. And that fee, Right, that 0.2% goes to those who have provided liquidity. So if you add liquidity here, you're receiving that fee. Um, then in return for providing liquidity, so you can add liquidity to any two token pairs. So if you wanted to add liquidity for uh, BNB and Link, which would mean that anytime someone swaps between BNB and Link, you would or Link and BNB, you would receive um, a portion of that 0.2% fee that was paid out. Right, so, um, and in return to providing liquidity, you will receive an LP token. So because this is decentralized and trustless, in a smart contract, what will happen is, is that you provide those, those coins to the exchange, as you just saw, and in return, they'll give you an LP token. So they'll give you whichever two coins you tr decided to, trans to add liquidity to, LP tokens. So if you added liquidity for um, BNB and Link, then you would see receive BNB link LP tokens. Now, now that we've got the basics out of the way, 
you can then take those LP tokens and move them over to farms here on uh, Goose Finance. Um, uh, you know what? Let me connect my wallet. So, oh, that oh, wallet is connected there. Sorry. There we go. Cool. And as you can see, these are all the different LP tokens, so the liquidity pool tokens. Um, and these are the APRs you're going to get. So, this is APR, so that's without compounding. Yeah. That's 362% uh, uh, up here on so the egg liquidity pool tokens are uh, have no deposit fee. That means you don't pay anything to put them in, and they have the highest APRs, 362%, 300%, 359%. Pretty good. It's pretty good stuff. Uh, APRs aren't quite as high if they're not egg tokens, but still very high. And there's a 1.5% deposit fee. That one point one point five percent deposit fee means that if you were to deposit one hundred dollars worth of that LP token, they would charge you one dollar fifty. And that would come out of the original amount. So you can so that works quite well. Because if we take a look here, in seven days you're gonna make two point two two point one two percent. So essentially in about what five days you make your money back under the feed paid, and then anything after that is pure profit. Not too bad. Um, and just to be clear, when you deposit your LP tokens, what you earn is egg tokens, right? So you deposit your, your egg BUSD, and in return, they pay out in egg. So you, you start earning egg. And the egg, so obviously, your returns will essentially be liable to fluctuations based on the price of egg, right? So if you bought, uh, you saw here, the price is up 20%, right? So if you were earning egg at the lower price, and all of a sudden the price dropped up 20%, and actually you've made 20% more than that, um, that APR that you were earning prior. But you know, obviously the same goes to the downside. Those are the farms for the LP tokens. You then have nests. So nests are actually quite a simple thing. It's straight cryptocurrencies. Just one cryptocurrency, no fancy liquidity provider moving around. It's just a cryptocurrency. So anybody from anywhere can just connect their MetaMask wallet and deposit any of the cryptocurrencies listed here. Um, yeah. Cake, BUSD, USDT, and be earning 70% APR. 68% APR, you know, and that, that 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 is on stable coins. So on stable coins, you're getting a 70% APR. That's incredible. Um, there's no, you know, you're not invested in a particular cryptocurrency, so there's no volatility there. These BUSD, USDT is pegged to the US dollar. So if you had free cash hanging, you know, just sitting around there, 70% APR, pretty good returns. And you earn that once again in egg. So you deposit your BUSD and you earn an egg. So an example here that I have 1,003, no, 1,063 BUSD. And in return, I'm earning, I've earned so far 1.2 egg. Not bad. I think that was in about a week or so. So I've covered, I've covered my deposit fee. And now I'm just, you know, in gains, making gains, guys, making gains. Um, next thing here is you have egg houses. So egg houses is uh, the opposite of what we just saw. So what you do is actually you earn BU don't know, you earn BUSD for depositing your egg. And mock and safe P. Do you want to see I have no idea what these tokens are, but I know what BUSD is, and you probably do too. Um the, the way to use these would be to earn egg here or earn egg here. So earn egg in the farm of the nests. And then essentially harvest those. So let's have a look at my nest. I could harvest that 1.2 egg and then stick it in the egg house. And then I could make a 24% APR on my egg, paid out in BUSD, making money on money. Lastly, you have the vaults. So the vaults are where you can essentially deposit cryptocurrencies um, and make. Um, uh, an APY uh, and it pays out in egg and in GUSD so it does both so it pays out both in egg and so GUSD just to be clear is the goose um, stable coin which is pegged to the US dollar um, which is 
pretty good. Um, currently, you can't trade it. Uh, I think that functionality will be launched shortly. Um, so have a look at a Twitter account where the uh, Goose Finance team are pretty active and keep you updated. Um, so you have quite a few different options and essentially how to make money here. Um, it's it, you know it's it's pretty good and right the one of the key things with the vaults is obviously the vaults allow you to deposit crypto um, LP tokens from other exchanges. So in that green here, you will see the Pancake Swap Auto. So it has um, L, it allows LP tokens from different exchanges other than uh, Greece Finance. So if you have some Pancake Swap um, LP tokens, check out and see whether the APY you can get here is higher than you'd get on the original pancake swap. Um, one thing to note, as always, with yield farming, DeFi, etc., is there's risk. You know, um, projects get hacked. Um, your cryptocurrency is always at risk. Though you know you're not going to get ridiculously high APYs if you know you don't carry some risk. Um, so just be aware of that. Do your own research. Look into the project and see what's going on. Um, and yeah, also was good to see is uh, the audit so it has been audited by Hacken and Certic um, guys you do your own research in regards to those audits in regards to how much you trust them I always tell everyone you know make sure you understand the risk of what you're doing when you go into certain things uh, that is exactly the same here uh, I hope that gives you a good overview of what egg finance is um, I've shown you you know me staking a bit of BUSD there making a decent return um, and I've been making a decent return on that um, pretty happy with so I uh, hope you've enjoyed hope you're a bit more familiar with goose finance and even if you don't want to use the platform um, you know it's a Binance smart chain uh, cryptocurrency um, the price is relatively cheap compared to you know the, the you know where the prices have been in the past so um, I'm liking it I'm liking it and I think I'm gonna be you know adding a little bit more to my uh, portfolio Lex MPI please like and subscribe have a nice day bye